Um, for the month of October, and now we're into November, um, but for the month of October, it says many um, economists have believed that the U.S. economy shook off two sluggish months of job growth and it regained, um, regained very little momentum in October, but apparently, emer but apparently emerging from a down downturn caused by the Delta variant surge. Um, the Bureau of Labor Statistics is set to release its October jobs report um, data, um, which was this morning at 8.30, but some forecasters are predicting that the economy added between 400,000 and 500,000 jobs in October, which is more than double the number that was added in September. The country still has about five million has about five million jobs five million jobs that were fewer um, than it did before the pandemic hit the country back in um in early twenty twenty in early twenty twenty. The labor market has endured a couple of lukewarm months after stronger growth in the spring and early summer, but this sudden slowdown shook the confidence of many businesses and consumers, and it scuttled more opti opti op optimistic projections for the fall. Um, but there have been some signs of a hiring boost in the past month as the tolls from the pandemic lesson. Um, the, the new unemployment claims have fallen every week for more than a month, down to a pandemic low of 269,000. The economists have long said that the public health crisis is the most major in, 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 in impediment to the recovery. The pandemic in recent months has taken a heavy toll on parents, particularly mothers, many of whom dropped out of the workforce to care for their families. But September had, a, had long been looked at as a time when many women would re-enter the workforce after schools had reopened, but the problems caused by the Delta variant upended those projects. So instead, another 309,000 women over the age of 20 have dropped out of the labor force. Um, Bill Adams, who's a senior um, economist for the PNC Financial Services Group, ha he, he basically said that the steady decrease in the unemployment claims are part of a handful of signs that indicate to a stronger month in the labor market in um, October. It points to a tightening job market and stronger job gains, he said, saying he was predicting about two to three times the level of jobs that were added from September when the country added 194,000 jobs. And anecdotally, some business owners say they have been able to make more progress in hiring in up to the last six weeks. But the business surveys, such as IHS on markets on purchasing managers index, show that service sector employees, like the largest portion of the economy by far, are increasing their workforce numbers at the quickest rate since June, when the country added nearly one million workers to their payrolls. The consumer confidence and the engine and the um, and the engine of the U.S. economy reversed a month-long slide in, in October, to mark higher numbers, according to the um, the conference board's um, monthly survey. Um, consumers were also the most optimistic about their own prospects to find jobs since 2000. The survey found the Treasury Secretary Janet L. Janet L. Yellen and Fed Chair um, Jerome Powell have said that they believe that the child care issues and related challenges are some of the biggest forces holding back the labor market, but these problems might take might take time to address that. A new report from the, from the Brookings Institution argues that reopening schools won't be enough to resolve the recent gender disparities in the labor market. Women are, over, are overrepresented in some of the sectors that have been the most hard hit by the pandemic, and some may decide not to go back into work for other reasons that um, the, um, people argue. As schools have... Um, As, um, 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 as schools have um, as schools have started up with the universal return to in-person education, we may. Um, as says, as schools have started up with um, a universal return to um, in-person education, we may see a rise in the labor force. Um, participation rates of women with young children. Stephanie Aronson and Francesca um, Alba wrote that, with that being said, the outbreaks of COVID-19 may discourage some mothers from returning to work, particularly those who have unvaccinated children at home. Moreover, the quarantining that has occurred at some schools have generated considerable uncertainty, which itself may be a drag. Um, on the woman's returns to um, work. But if you like the video, give the video a like and subscribe to my channel, RBW King, and also hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video comes out. And thanks for listening.